Hey guys, Robert here with the Piss and Slap channel, and I was going to do a regular vlog, and I'm actually talking in this video, but after reviewing it, it was basically just like giving you guys an idea of, hey, um, this is how my 401k in retirement works, and that's, I don't, I don't think I want to put a video out for you guys about that. Um, you know, I just, really what I wanted to put together in today's video was more or less like uh, why I haven't been staying to my normal Monday upload schedules. Um, there's been there's been changes, you know. Uh, for those of you guys that follow real close on all the other uh, social medias, you know, uh, I, I no longer work uh, where I used to. I've I've gotten a new job. Um, the new job's awesome. If you guys were wondering, I'm, I'm not gonna tell you what it is I do. For those of you that are super close, like my my best friends that might watch my videos but might not, um, you know. But for the rest of you guys, um, I'm just gonna leave you hanging. So sorry about that. Um, but it's just kind of one of those things I like to protect uh, that little bit. Um, and I'm sure you could if you really wanted to be super creepy. I guess you could go digging around and find out where I work. Um, but you know, let's just, let's just leave it at that. Um, so why is it I'm not putting out videos? Um, part of it is because of where I work. Um, and it's not that my work is restricting my videos. It's just that, um, the time that I have, like if I were to ride to work and do a video, I would be like sitting on the interstate and I don't really like doing interstate videos, like just here's a section of I-84 in Idaho, you know, and you guys are going to watch it how many times before you get sick and just tune out of my channel. Um, second thing is, is uh, the time in the morning that I head to work, it's like, it's, and you guys know, if you're a motorcycle rider, ugh, a motorcycle rider, um, that there are two worst times in a day that you could particularly ride. That is when the sun is coming up and that when the sun is going out. Are going down and uh, if you're heading east and you're on the west coast or it doesn't matter where you're at if you're heading east in the morning um, going straight into the sun that you know, people nowadays don't really pay attention and could run you over um, so I already did a vlog about that worst time to ride I'll throw it up there in the links for you guys um, but same thing was the time I get off there's lots of daylight to go riding but with the responsibilities of being a dad, uh, I gotta go get the kiddos and stuff. And by the time I get the kiddos, get home, get everybody dinner and stuff, it's, I'm out of steam, man. I don't wanna really go out and ride. I mean, I wanna ride, but where I wanna ride, it's like an hour and a half away. But, you know, I get to see this uh, cool, cool area. This actually, uh, this road right here is about 30 minutes away from my house uh, on the Tiger. It takes me about 45 minutes to an hour to do on the DRZ just because it's a little slower. Uh, but it's more geared for the DRZ, uh, especially with this last trip. Uh, my buddy and I have found some uh, really cool trails. Um, and uh, if you guys are wondering, this is uh, the Boise Ridge Road off of Bogus Basin Road. Uh, you just right before the ski resort, there's a little turn off there at the right that uh, we started at the beginning of this video. And you just can you can follow this guy all the way out to. Uh, there's a couple different spots it comes out to depending on where you turn off. Um, but you can come out to Roby Creek, you can come out at 8th Street. Um, for you guys that don't know, that are, you know, not here in the Idaho area or have never ridden this area. Um, so that's, uh, that's pretty much it. That's, uh, that's why I'm not doing videos. It's just, uh, you know, I want to I wanna produce really good content for you guys. I'd like to ask you what you guys want to see, but that's kind of like one of my rules is to never really ask you guys what you want to see. Um, and... It's not like I'm trying to be rude or anything. It's just uh, me as a content creator, um, you know, my ideas. And then, you know, it's basically, if you don't like it, you guys just don't watch it or you watch five seconds of it and turn it off. And, you know, I see, oh, well, that video is crap. So then we move on from that. And, you know, obviously on the flip side of it, if I did ask you, you know, half of you might want one thing, half of you might want the other. So there's, you know, as many of us as motovloggers, have chatted back and forth about that topic um, there's no right answer to it and you'll never make everybody happy so we can all agree on one thing if you're here watching the video for off-road riding and motovlogging this is what makes us happy you know 
It's a nice road, some trees, some green. Heck, it doesn't even have to be green or trees. It could be a desert somewhere in Arizona or wherever else there's deserts. I mean, we all, there's deserts all over the world. Um, well, let's talk a little bit about uh, what I've been doing. Um, uh, so far this year, uh, besides going out and riding every night like I used to, uh, becoming more of a dad, um, I've tried to uh, plan other rides, you know, like going out to Washington. That was a lot of fun. Um, and I would always encourage you guys that uh, if you've never been to a rally, you know, I'm kind of one of those guys that I'm, it's weird. I have a real hard time uh, going to rallies and stuff because I don't know what to expect. I'm not a great rider by any means, and I always feel like I'm going to show up with something like, you know, the jalopy and I won't be able to keep up and I'm going to be holding everybody up on the trails and stuff. And that didn't, that, you know, for my first rally, uh, that wasn't the case. You know, it was, you know, I had a great time. I blended right in and, you know, just, I don't know, it's weird. It was just me. It's the type of person I am, you know, so I ride solos because one, uh, you know, I don't know if I'm riding too fast for somebody or if I, if I ride too slow, which always seems to be... <laughs> Um, which always seems to be the case. Well, not always, but you ask my buddy Tyler. He's he's the one guy that I've met that says I, I ride too fast. But this ride, I actually I took it easy. Um, if you guys are here in the Boise area, um, I noticed on the uh, on some of the forums that some of you guys are getting adventure bikes. Dirt bikes, dual sports, whatever. Um, dual sports and adventure bike, guys. Um you know, I'll, uh, I'm going to try to do something new this year that I haven't done in the past, and that's uh, throw out an invite to you guys, um, not like through YouTube or anything. I mean, obviously, if you're watching my video, you're going to hear it here first, but uh, I'm going to try to get on those forums and uh, throw it out there so that, you know, not only that we get the chance to meet up, but, you know, just that the, the better part of that is the chance to get out and ride and uh, maybe explore some new areas to go ride. Um I would have never thought that there were all these cool trails just so close to Boise. And I've only scratched the surface of the ones that are just like right here in this area. Um, and you'll see throughout this video that, you know, we turn off on maybe two or three of them and just go check them out. We actually found a really cool camp spot. So uh, that'll play in later on in the year. Um, and the, it'll it's not going to be in this video, but it's going to be in the, the next video coming out after this one is uh, some single track that we... That we found and took the tiger down. It was a, it was a bit of a, it's a bit exciting. Uh, my buddy, he's a, he's a pretty awesome rider. I mean, you figure how much a Triumph Tiger 800 weighs, and doing it on a, you know, doing single track with it, on stock, you know, 9010 tires. That was impressive. So, anyway, uh, I've I've blabbed your ear off here for just over eight minutes. Coming up on nine. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, shut up now um, and throw some music in, and we'll catch you guys on the next one. If you have any comments, questions, uh, information, whatever, you know, I try to reach out to you guys. If you guys throw a comment down there, questions, whatever, um, I always get back at you. It might be a while, but I try to do it within the day. So my name is Robert with the Piston Slap channel, guys. Thanks so much for tuning in and watching today. Uh, sorry it wasn't like one of those super awesome, spectacular moto vlogs. I was just more like an update of, you know, why I haven't been putting out videos. So, there you have it. I will talk to you guys on the next one. Ride safe. Mm -hmm.